హలో ఫ్రెండ్స్ వెల్కమ్ బ్యాక్ దిస్ ఇస్ భరత్ కుమార్ ఫ్రమ్ నెప్చన్ మరీ ఇన్ఫో వర్ నోలెజ్ హెస్ నో బౌండ్రీస్ సో టుడే వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు డిస్కస్ అబౌట్ ది సబ్జెక్ట్ ఆఫ్ షిప్ కన్స్ట్రక్షన్స్ అండ్ ద కంటెంట్ ఈస్ కవర్ అప్ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ షిప్స్ సో వితౌట్ అ వెస్టింగ్ ఆఫ్ టైమ్ లెట్ స్టార్ట్ టుడేస్ సెషన్ సో హియర్ దేర్ ఆర్ అ ట్వెల్వ్ కేటగిరీ ఆఫ్ షిప్స్ ఫస్ట్ వన్ ఇస్ అ జనరల్ కార్గో షిప్స్ general cargo ships are easily identified by the cranes on their back and the general cargo ships carry everything from cut timber to heavy machinery now the general cargo ships make up 20% of the world fleet now second type is the specialized cargo ships specialized cargo ships carry extremely heavy loads and unusually shaped cargo such as a smaller ship oil rigs or building structures now the specialized cargo ships make up only a very small 0.3% of the world fleet third one is a container ships container ships are large long ships that are specifically designed for carrying their cargo in containers now the containers hold things such as a clothing textiles food products and electronics safely inside them now container ships make up 6% of the world fleet fourth one is the dry bulk carriers dry bulk carriers are easily identified by the hatches they have on their deck the term dry bulk means any non liquid cargo in a large amount such as a grain or cement or shredded timber now dry bulk carrier make up 12.7% of the fleet fifth one is the liquid bulk tankers liquid bulk tankers carry liquid chemicals or oil in a large amounts because liquid bulk tankers usually carry flammable liquids there are no smoking signs everywhere on a board to ensure safety of the crew and cargo liquid bulk tankers make up 14.7% of the world fleet now sixth type is liquefied natural gas tankers liquefied natural gas tankers carry liquefied natural gas lng in a special tanks that are shaped like a circles half of the tank is seen above the deck liquefied natural gas tankers are very easy to identify because of their hulls have a lng written across them LNG tankers make up only 2% of the current fleet. Seventh type is liquefied petroleum gas tanker. Liquefied petroleum gas tanker carry liquefied petroleum gas LPG and have a special tank to carry it in much like LNG tankers. Liquefied petroleum gas tankers are easy to identify because of the LPG written across their hull. LPG tankers make up 0.9% of the world fleet. Now, at the type is Roro cargo ships. Roro stands for roll on, roll off. Roro's cargo ships transport cargo, trailers, trucks and even train cars. Roro's travel far distances around the world and very easy large. Roro cargo ships up 1.8% of the world fleet. Now passenger ships passenger ships carry people and include cruise ships and ferries big and small passenger ships make up 8% of the world fleet offshore vessels offshore vessels supply important goods to offshore oil and gas platform they travel out to deep water to restock food and transport workers now without offshore vessels offshore operation would be extremely difficult to maintain offshore vessels make up approximately 9% of the world fleet now 11th type is a service vessels service vessels include many types of ships such as cable laying ships research vessels and ice breaking ships each type of service vessel holds very important positions in assisting development exploring and learning and navigating the ocean service vessels make up about 4% of the world fleet the last type is tugs tug boats are the most important vessels in a near shore operations because they assist the large ships such as container ships roros 
move in a tight spaces. Tugboats help large ships dock safely and prevent accidents in ports by tugging them or pushing them in the right direction. Due to importance of tugboats, they make up almost 20% of the world fleet. So friend, it was a brief detail about the types of ships. So what's next? We are going to discuss about the ship's dimensions in upcoming video lecture. Till that, keep learning, keep growing.